Hello there everybody and welcome to another Let's Play here on GTA World with the LSPD. As you guys might be able to hear, I have a new headset. I finally replaced my old HyperX headset with a new HyperX Cloud Alpha. It sounds much better to the ears, much more pleasing. The bass sounds a lot better. You can hear a lot more sounds than what I used to. And from what I can tell, which you guys can obviously judge a bit better than I can, the microphone sounds a lot better. So hopefully you guys have a much better audio quality with my uh, voice now uh, hopefully you guys enjoy the new sound of the microphone because obviously as you guys know whenever you buy a headset it takes a little bit of getting used to both from the sound coming into your headset and from the sound going out so welcome guys to another let's play it also enabled a couple nvidia filters with the uh, alt z button or whatever so that way uh, the game looks a little bit sharper and a little bit crisper than what it did probably from the last time you guys had seen and thankfully with no ill side effects as far as uh that goes uh, from enabling that so the game does look a little bit better because like I said my GPU is just not good enough to run uh, quant V or any of the uh, EMB sided graphics mods it just cannot handle it with the uh, old 1060 in there right now we got almost 600 players online so hopefully this is an interesting patrol folks this is actually the first let's play that I've done uh, without it being live streamed for a few weeks, actually, because my last two Let's Plays have been live streamed, but today we're going to do it the old-fashioned way and give you guys a normal Let's Play video. So hopefully you guys enjoy it. Like I said, I like to keep it mixed up. I like to do a mixture of live and a mixture of the old style that uh, you guys have all grown accustomed to, where I cut out all the little boring tidbits and try and keep it as interesting as I can. Haven't been online too much within the last week. It's been a little bit of a busy week for me with work. This week might be a little busy too, but uh, shouldn't be too too bad. So hopefully I can get a live stream with you guys sometime this week and or this coming weekend because I have a long weekend actually. And speaking of a new headset, I also got myself a new keyboard. It's just the Corsair. What's it called? Let me see. It's Corsair K55 RGB Pro. It was just like sixty dollars, and honestly, it's a membrane keyboard. And I know a lot of people are all about the mechanical keyboards and whatnot, but I wasn't paying the extra thirty dollars for a mechanical your channel. keyboard when this one sounds right. Hello, I'm doing a let's play. What's going on? Oh no, I just wanted to check how it was with you. What? I just wanted to check how you were doing. Oh, I'm doing good, but I am recording right now, so you can say hi to the fellas. Hello. <laughs> Have you been? I've done it quite a while. Um, pretty good, pretty good. Busy, but good. Yeah, I'm taking out the old interceptor. Uh, actually, I haven't driven in any but the interceptor for the last like week and a half for whatever reason. You got the uh, the slick pup interceptor, the normal one. Just the normal one. I had the oh, slick okay, top gotcha. one out yesterday. Has it very busy online? Sorry. Has it been very busy online? No clue. I just logged in. Oh, same here. I'm literally like three minutes into this video, so <laughs> who the hell knows <laughs> what's gonna happen? The time change happened today. I know you guys over in Europe. The time change happens at a different time of the year, right? Yeah, it happened like last week somewhere. Oh, yeah. I just went back today for us here in North America. I wish they just leave it the way it was. I hate it when it gets dark at like 5 p.m. at night. It's annoying. You leave work, it's dark. You go to work, it's dark. Yeah, true. It sucks. I was on yesterday for an hour or so. Wrote a couple of parking tickets and not too much happened. But might have something to do with the fact that there were only 200 players online that time of day. Probably gonna go run radar or something here soon. So for those of you that don't recognize the voice, this is Camilla Thompson. Known him for quite a while now since uh hell I've known you before traffic division, right? And I've been in traffic now how long? Probably six months, seven months. Yeah, you you knew me I was in traffic and that's how you knew me, yeah. Yeah, I was in traffic and then you made it in the, the batch after or something, I believe. Oh, yeah, 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 that's what happened. I joined, like, after you came in already, but not much after. And here we are. Now we're traffic folk for life. And I, I was telling people in, the, I think, my last Let's Play, I said, if you want a division that doesn't, like, take itself too, too seriously, like, they treat this like it's still a game at the end of the day, but we're there to have fun. It, it's definitely traffic division. Like, so many of the other divisions are paperwork written. And traffic is 
pretty light on the paperwork, thank God. It's one of those that... It, it, well, I mean, it's kind of a branch of patrol still traffic, but, like, it's just one of those that you get to log on, do have some fun, do your thing, and you don't have to worry about filling out 300 pages of paperwork to go with it. So it's just nice that way. And, I mean, for those that like the shooting, obviously they can do the friggin' uh, SWAT and whatnot, but I'm not about that life. Well, it's the thing, uh, if you want to have, like, different R kind of RP, like, traffic is the RP where you have a lot of interaction with people, yeah. uh, and you can set the tone from your traffic stops, so you can either decide if you want to have, if, like, if they're being, uh, if they're being uh, mean to you, or, like, Write them up for everything you. you got, and if they're being okay, yeah, then you can decide to give them a warning. It, it's always, the thing is traffic stops, it's always... You don't know what to expect when you pull someone over. No, that's just it. Speaking of pulling someone over, I'm about to do that. They're doing 82 in a 60 zone on San Andreas Ave. Probably just be a warning to be honest, but you know, always gotta go see what's up. I've said I finally got a new keyboard, it's so much nicer to type on. Because my last keyboard, almost every button stuck. Alright, gonna look up this guy's plate information here and see what he's got. Hopefully uh, nothing too crazy, because then it could be a very, very interesting traffic stop, whether we want it to be or not. So, person's name is Abbott Mill. Look them up. They have a driving license, hunting license. Uh... Do, 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 do. do have a couple notification or uh, previous tickets for speeding, actually. Uh... The license is suspended once before. I mean, 80 is not that bad, but it's still kind of oof. Alright. User left your channel. I had to set my tag on this, uh, teen speak to do not disturb because it's kind of awkward sometimes when people come in. I, I don't mind it, I really don't, but it, it can be a little awkward sometimes when people come in and, uh, what do you call it? When they come into your channel and you're trying to being in the middle of a let's play. Not bad at all, if I'm honest, and yours. Alright, so I pulled them over, like I said, for doing 80 in that, uh, under the bridge over there, so we're, in a, we're just pulling them over. I'm probably going to give them a warning anyways. 80's not that bad. I mean, it's definitely ticketable, but it's not the worst I've seen.
Alright. Like I said, I'm probably just going to have to go with the ticket. They're pretty uh, compliant here. So like I said, I'm not out here to write tickets all the time. But just pulling people over to get the RP out of it is more fun to me than writing everybody a ticket. Let me know in the comments, guys, if you enjoy the new headset sound or if you preferred the old one. But unfortunately, the old one, it, it's pretty much, uh, it's toast. So yeah, you're not going to be getting it back even if you did like the old one. All right, let's go run their information. Come on, let me in my car. Let's see what we got on Abbas Miller. All right, so they're partners, actually. They're married. Abbas Miller and Abba Milley are married. They were charged back in January for a motor vehicle contest. Whoops. Uh, then the only other infraction is speeding back in May. So considering this GTA world, that's not too bad at all. I haven't driven the Crown Vic in a long time. I probably should here again soon, just because, you know, that's that used to be my main car. Now I seem to be driving the Interceptor for a while. Stop. Get me in my car. There we go. Alright, we're clear from here. Go back to our radar spot. San Andreas has a pretty busy street, so you always get a lot of people speeding under there because they, uh, they never see you sitting there, and it's a very, very easy street to speed on. I just wanted the exit. Oops. I'm a rebel. I'm not going to sit here too, too long. I'll probably just sit here another couple minutes, see what we get, and then I'll roll back out on regular patrol because uh, I know you guys don't like seeing me sit in one spot for too, too long. But yeah. Hopefully you've all had a good week. Is everybody ready for winter? Because I'm not. I absolutely hate winter. Worst season of the year to me. I have a long driveway. It takes like two to three hours to snow blow. Then I gotta go buy winter tires and blah blah blah. I've got my car undercoated finally, but holy lord, I hate winter. It's expensive. Not to mention the heating costs on top of it. Winter is definitely my least favorite time of the year, especially cost-wise. Alright guys, we are going after this taxi who just drove on the wrong side of the road, just hit the sidewalk. 
and is 110% speeding. Alright, this guy is all over the damn place. We're gonna call for backup on this one because, uh, pretty sure he's not gonna be driving his car here for very long. Oops, I meant to say Teuton 17. I had a typo. Alright, we're gonna wait for backup here because this guy, that was 100% reckless driving. So, uh, we're just gonna wait for backup here for a second. The guy drove on the wrong side of the road, blew through two stop signs, and was doing over a 95 mile an hour. So, don't know if I'll take him to jail yet or not, but he's definitely, uh, not gonna be going very far after he leaves here, that's for sure. So, uh, that, that guy was definitely a menace. This guy isn't getting his man picked up, that's for sure. Alright. See, my character's a little pissed off at the way he drove, so he's not going to treat this guy very nice at all, let me put it that way. That guy was a menace. <laughs> My character's pissed at him. This guy might only just be going to jail. He's not very happy with him right now.
All right, what do we got here? Do, 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 do. All right. This guy clearly doesn't learn. You know what? For how bad that was, we're going to arrest him. All right, let's get this man arrested. I rarely arrest for reckless driving. Rarely. All right. Yeah, I rarely, rarely, rarely arrest for reckless driving. Alright, let's get this man frisked and see what he's got. Alright.
<laughs> Someone stole that person's car. All right, we're gonna get him into the back of the cruiser. All right, so. We literally went from letting the care care driver off with the purple to arresting this guy for reckless driving. Yeah, typing on this keyboard so much better. Just works better. Yeah, everything's better. Yeah, I'm only doing this because my character knows that if you cite this guy, it's not going to solve his issues. I really love the Valor light bar on top of this Torrance. I prefer like a regular light bar, but like compared to the Argents, this is just so much better. Alright, we're gonna take this guy to the station, get him processed. See, technically, like, anything under an hour, we take them to Mission Bro Station 4, so I just kind of RP it as misdemeanor, not misdemeanor. Like, you know, you just kind of got to put some RP technique into it. You can't say, oh, you're just going to jail for an hour. AKA an hour. Like, you just gotta kinda make the times up to fit the IC, uh, punishment. Like, you can't just say, oh, I'm arresting you one day for evading, like, those kinds of things. <laughs> you just kinda gotta make it up IC Lee and go with the flow.
All right. Christ, it's locked in my car. There we go, that's better. It was locked in my car instead of unlocking the door. There we go. Alright. See, I know this guy is probably going to give us an issue in the future, so I'm just doing preventative maintenance here on this man. We don't really have, like, a proper, uh, thing. Alright. Alrighty, print screen that and then put it into a photo editor real quick so that way I have it. Oh, then I'll ideally send that to my email later. All right. I don't really know how fingerprint scanners work, so I'm just going to kind of guess as I go. I'm just going to be honest with you. But it's just about the RP. All right. Come on. No gum or candy in the cells. That's boring.
Alright guys, we have him booked. He is arrested now. So, uh... We're going to end this Let's Play here, because I have to go to the arrest report and whatnot, and then I'm going to log off. So I hope you all enjoyed another Let's Play, guys. Hope you enjoyed the new microphone. So I will see you all next time for another Let's Play video here on GTA World.